and welcome back to CBS News 24-7. Former President Donald Trump is focusing on immigration on the campaign trail. Trump is in Arizona today where he will be touring the U.S.-Mexico border just south of Tucson. And that is where we find CBS News campaign reporter Olivia Rinaldi. Olivia, thank you for joining us. Hi, Juliet. How are you? I'm doing great. So why don't you tell us about this tour today and kind of what's happening right now directly behind you and where you are? Yeah, Julia, we're on the border, the U.S.-Mexico border in Arizona. Now, this will be Donald Trump's first visit to the border in Arizona this cycle. He's done two other visits, but those have been in Texas. So Trump says he's coming here today to inspect the border. So to my right here, we've got the border wall. But to the left, we have all of these materials of the border wall, what they've used for construction. So Trump says he's coming here today to inspect that, to talk with some of the border officials about what is going on here, some of the things they've experienced with the flow of migrants across the border and then he also says he's going to be talking to some families of victims who have been uh, the victims of uh, migrants who have come across the border so he says he's going to be talking with families there so doing that inspection and then having those remarks behind me and you know as well as I do that immigration is so central to this campaign and it's also coming on the final day of the Democratic National Convention and that's what's really key here is Trump wants to make immigration so central that while Vice President Kamala Harris is delivering her uh, nomination acceptance speech tonight, he's going to be reminding people about immigration, about the flow of migrants, and making that uh, one of his key points. Yeah, Olivia, we're also hearing that former President Trump may be getting an endorsement from uh, Robert F. Kennedy Jr. So what are you hearing about that possibility and the timeline? A lot of rumors swirling around that. We do know that tomorrow Donald Trump will be going to Las Vegas for an event talking about tax on tips. And then he'll be going, coming back to Arizona, rather, for an event in Phoenix. But we're also hearing that Robert Kennedy Jr. will also be in Phoenix tomorrow. And he says he has a big announcement about the state of the race. And that piqued a lot of our interest about what that could possibly be. We're learning a lot more that he is considering perhaps suspending his campaign and endorsing Trump. Now, Trump officials that I have spoken to have pointed this back to the Kennedy campaign, said that decision is entirely up to him. So we will be watching closely tomorrow to see if there is a big endorsement. And that is something, Juliet, that would really shake up this race. That would uh, perhaps give a boost to former President Donald Trump as, uh, you know, Kennedy has taken some share of his support. So something we'll be watching there, especially as we head closer towards November. I can't help but hear all of the music behind you. Is that where the rally is going to take place and where he'll be touring in the area? Is it outdoor, indoor? What is the setup? We're outdoor. You know, you're hearing some of that music. I am right next to the speaker, so it okay. is quite loud. Apologies if you're having trouble hearing me there. It's not quite a rally, but it'll be remarks that he's having behind. And so he will be doing that border tour first and then coming and giving those remarks behind me. No, we don't mind the music. We feel like we're there and we kind of know what the scene will be like. So thanks for bearing with us as I ask you questions to the music. Yeah, you're in the heat with me. <laughs> we are. Olivia, thank you yeah. for your report. Appreciate it.